My name is Kain Chandler with Tech Pro, and today we are going to be looking at question 30 on our machine learning question and answer series. And today's question will be How is Bayes' theorem related to classification and regression? So I'm actually covering a wide array of questions from different angles, not really straightforward questions, sometimes very clear cut questions, but sometimes questions that might be twisted to actually check if you understand these concepts. I've discussed Bayes' theorem, I've discussed classification, I've discussed regression in this series, but now how are they related? So to answer a question like this, what you simply do is to state the Bayes' theorem and also if you have it, if you know a model for classification and regression, also state it. So now logistic Regression, I think, how is Bayes' theorem related to logistic regression? Okay, I think I've mixed it up, so I'm going to... So let's stick with the question of uh, all this. So actually, we are talking about logistic regression. So let me just correct it once and for all. Logistic. All right, so logistic regression is a kind of regression where the model models an output that is uh, discrete of values maybe 0 or 1 is binary output. Now Bayes theorem is a way to find uh, posterior probability using prior probability as well as the likelihood. So let's just state it. So when it comes to Bayes, we are determined uh, determine, uh, Posterior from, I'm going to explain this uh, right now from the prior, from the prior. Then for logistic, uh, log logistic regression, uh, determine. Um, binary response. Okay. So let's start with Bayes. So Bayes theorem has it that we are trying to determine the posterior probability from the prior. So let's say we have probability of um, are trying to estimate the probability of a particular parameter theta of a population given the the observations we have. So in this case, this now is the posterior uh, probability of theta, the parameter to be estimated given the set of observations we have. So it's going to be equal to, in this case, we now have x of theta. So now this is called likelihood, but now we are not much interested in it, times the probability of theta. Now this is the prior. This is what is called prior, and this is called posterior. So keep it in mind, and we divide by P of X, marginal, right? This is marginal, prior, likelihood, this is posterior. So when it comes to logistic regression, So in this case, we are trying to also find, in this case, we are trying to determine the probability of x. So both Bayes theorem try to uh, explain a probabilistic, is a probabilistic model. Logistic regression is also a probabilistic model. Is equal to e to the power of beta 0 plus uh, a beta 1 x all over 1 plus e to the power of beta 0 plus beta 1 x. So one thing I want you to take home from here is for both of them, we are trying to estimate some probability. It's unlike linear regression whereby we are trying to estimate uh, a linear model and trying to tune the parameters. In this case, we are trying to just est uh, estimate probabilities. In this case, we are trying to estimate the posterior probability in this case, we are trying to estimate the total uh, probability of x or the marginal probability of x. So if you're able to explain this, this is the relationship between Bayes theorem uh, and logistic regression. I'm going to actually stop here and I'm going to 
would like to thank you for viewing. This concludes this set of questions because it's a set of 10 questions each. So in the next set of questions, which actually will be 31 to 40, I think we might go into some advanced uh, topics. For instance, I actually made a list and uh, question 31 to 40 will actually be looking at sampling techniques, clustering, and we'll also be looking at conditional probabilities and stuff like that.